Fox gone after that and crashed it away through square leg for four. Try and keep the strike. But Paul Adams is uh, not a bad batsman down the order, tail ender. He certainly can stick around. Man gone behind square, some 15 metres from the fence. That's well timed by Pollard. That'll roll a bit away for another boundary. Great counter-attack from Sean Pollard. Follow on only 74 away. It's carved away through cover this time for four more. It's fantastic entertainment for the uh, spectators in the ground. Attacking player gives himself room and slashes it through the covers. Look at the concentration. Good shot. England desperate for two wickets. Good stroke. Room it on. Time beautifully. It'll bring Pollock four. Some good innings by the South African all-rounder who's done nothing with the bat so far in this series. Timing here, almost to perfection. Not out the middle of the bat, but goodness me, the timing was good. His fifth boundary, and he moves to 38, the Sean Pollock. 124, the total. Two wickets left. Gone for it this time, and connected, and got four more. Great aggressive batting from Sean Pollock. Exciting stuff. The down, the, down the track, and launched high over long arm. Four for Pollock, takes him past 50. South Africa need it now. Good shot by Pollock down the wicket. No one back. Into the air. Down again. Over the top this time. All the way for six. South Africa, Sean Pollock. And the timing in this shot, perfect. Straight down the ground, high, wide and handsome. Straight into the crowd, and they love it too. He's got him. Pollock's dragged it on. Paddock's deserved that success. That's his seventh wicket. These are his best bowling analysis ever in Test match. Well, do you feel if they're going to win this game, they have to. Sean Pollock, chance in his arm, wants to offer. 